This lesson will cover the following topics. Emergency Brake Assist During emergency braking, many drivers depress the brake pedal rapidly but do not maintain the effort required to produce maximum braking. The result of this hesitation is an increase in the vehicle stopping distance. When the emergency brake assist system detects a fast speed of depressing the brake pedal, it should perform two actions. Assist the driver's maximum braking effort in order to activate ABS regulation much quicker and maintain ABS regulation until the vehicle comes to a complete stop or until the brake pedal is released. In a conventional braking system, if the driver maintains the braking effort, the atmospheric pressure stops entering the rear chamber, thus limiting the braking assistance. The role of emergency brake assist is to keep the atmospheric pressure inlet open, independent of the effort exerted by the driver. The system is therefore independent of the application on the brake pedal. The Renault range has two types of emergency brake assist. Manual emergency brake assist and electrical emergency brake assist. The manual emergency brake assist function amplifies the effort provided by the brake pedal. The operating principle is to provide the braking assistance with continuous atmospheric pressure. The manual emergency brake assist system has a reaction disc, a washer, a ball device, a piston follower, and a control rod. On the manual emergency brake assist system, the operating principle lies in keeping the reaction disc compressed via the ball device. Now let's take a look at an emergency braking system. The control rod pushes the piston follower. The atmospheric pressure enters the rear chamber. The ball support moves forward and frees the ball. The ball prevents the support returning and keeps the reaction disc compressed. The piston follower remains open, allowing the atmospheric pressure to pass through. The operation is based on the pedal speed of depression. The operating principle of the electrical emergency brake assist system is to activate a valve via an electromagnet. This valve maintains the entry of the atmospheric pressure into the rear chamber. Activation of the emergency brake assist system depends on the following two parameters. The speed of depression of the pedal and the force applied to the brake pedal. The electrical emergency brake assist system uses the following components. A brake pedal travel sensor informing the computer of the speed of depression of the pedal. A micro switch informing the computer of the release of the brake pedal and an electromagnet that controls the opening of the atmospheric pressure valve. These three elements are linked to the ABS computer which manages the emergency brake assist function. Now let's take a look at a braking system with activation of the electrical emergency brake assist system. When braking with the emergency brake assist activated, the driver rapidly applies the brake pedal. The effort is maintained before reaching the maximum level of braking assistance. The computer controls the electromagnet, which has the effect of opening up a passageway between the atmospheric pressure and the rear chamber. The force applied by the assistance continues until the maximum force is achieved. If the driver releases the brake pedal, the computer shuts off the electromagnet supply. This information comes from the micro switch incorporated in the electromagnet. In this section we covered the following points. The emergency brake assist system assists the driver's effort to quickly activate maximum braking and to maintain this effort until the vehicle comes to a complete stop. The system is therefore independent of the application on the brake pedal. The manual emergency brake assist system comprises a reaction disc, a washer, a ball device, a piston follower and a control rod. The manual emergency brake assist system allows the atmospheric pressure to enter the rear chamber. Activation of the emergency brake assist system 
depends on the speed of depression of the pedal and the force applied to the brake pedal. The brake pedal travel sensor, the micro switch and the electromagnet are linked to the ABS computer which manages the emergency brake assist function. The computer controls the electromagnet which has the effect of opening up a passageway between the atmospheric pressure and the rear chamber.